found a battery that works. Good. What kind of sandwiches did you make me? Ham and cheese, buddy. Yeah. But yeah. listen, listen, listen. We're gonna have to stop. Oven roasted ham. Oh, really? With Havati cheese. I swear, the ham and cheese that I bought at Sobeys yesterday cost more than my boat. <laughs> but we better earn it. Gotta be some big pike still hanging in these bays here, eh? Yeah, they have. They've cut all the trees down. Look. There's actually grass over there now. They're still on every little possible tree they can get on here, though. Look. There's got to be 20 or 30 nests in each of these trees. <laughs> For the benefit of the viewers at home, I cannot explain the disgusting stench here right now of ammonia. Not me. <laughs> Are you sure? This time it's not me. It smells like the dirtiest, dankest bathroom you've ever been in in your life. Always a good one, buddy. It's a nice one, look. I got a cradle right in this locker here. Oh, look at the mouth on him. It's a nice fish. He inhaled that giant trout, buddy. Look at this pike. Downtown Toronto. Doesn't get any better than this, buddy. Look at that. Look at that trout. He nailed it. It's right down his throat. You know what? I'm just going to grab him. He's not going anywhere. Sure. Yeah, I'm going to handle him. Get him out by hand. Holy shit. He nailed that thing. Okay. Let's see if I can get him behind the head. There we go. We got him. Wow. Look at that. He inhaled that thing. I'm going to do this without getting hooks in my hand. I got me a stump fish. That's straight in the hook. I hit that, set the hook. Shit. What happens when you set the hook on a log? Magic bait. Yeah. Straighten it back out. It kind of defeat the object. Like having a boat and having to take a boat to your boat before you can go boating. I'm thinking we're gonna get one back here. What are you throwing now? Oh. 
I don't know if those uh, Muskoka techniques are going to work down here, buddy. I think we'll go back to that little bay in a minute when those guys move out. Did they move out? Okay. I don't mind going in there with the husky jerk. Good old husky jerk. Every year we come here, they do seem to hang in that bay a lot, right? I guess it's like a natural little spawning area for them. Well, because it drops into that deep basin there, right? So they're probably just sitting out there having a little bite before they head back out into the lake. They've also put all this, they've done a pretty good job putting all this wood and stuff in up here to protect the shoreline. And they've got these little spawning areas over in the back. See where the gates are? Right there. Let the fish go back there and spawn un undisturbed. Yeah, it's pretty cool what they're doing down here. Yeah. I don't know if the pike I'm looking for will be able to fit through those bars though. Stick fish. Look at that. About 32 inches. Live release. All right, you want to go back in that bay? I got to switch it up though. I got to throw a couple of shots with the jerk bait here. That was a big fish. You see him? Oh, here he is, here he is, right here, right here. Yeah, he's right down here. That's a good fish. He's really not interested, it seems, in eating though. Which kind of sucks, because he's big. Where'd he go? I think that's... Is that him there? Oh my god. I think I peed myself a little bit when I saw him. Here he is, here. Right in front of the boat. I don't know if you can see him on the camera here, but we got a big pike just hanging out right here. He's heading that way. Just sunning themselves, eh? Kind of like us, trying to warm up. Yeah. Oh, he's coming, he's coming. Hey, look, look. Oh, Jesus Christ. He had it on the end of his nose. I'm just going to leave it. Here he is, right here. Can you see him? Right there. He's coming, he's coming. Watch. Watch. Oh, come on, buddy. Okay, give me a shot. They're, they're fat, though, eh? There's a few of them in here. If you can see him on the camera guys but there's pike all over the place here he's a fatty oh my yeah he's wide he's like that wide oh shit i gotta get my bait in
Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. Oh, I got a glare on the water here. I can hardly see. Oh my god. Look, he just turned away. Here he comes. Here he comes. I'm just gonna let it sit there. It's suspending right in front of him. He's staring at it. Oh my God, what are you doing? Oh, he's coming back. Is yours there? See if he'll eat yours. Oh, good God, I don't know what to do here. Um, I'm gonna try this one, here. As he quietly grabs another rod. Hello, man, they're, uh, they're playing a little hot, uh, hot to get. It. That's all right. We're not quitters. What's your strategy, man? Well, hopefully my... My captain can put me on some fish. That's my strategy. Oh no, it's my fault. Right? It usually <laughs> yeah, is. Yeah. Especially when I phone and tell Paula. Oh, Sean doesn't know where the fish are. Well, here we are. Perseverance, Us. man. Arcy Wicey. You're a member here, aren't you? Yeah. yeah. I am. Yeah. Should we do it here? Shit, that thing costs a mile. <laughs> I got a swim bait with a... Are you okay there, buddy? <laughs> oh, there's a fish. On that swim bait. That's a nice one. GoPro start recording. Nice looking. Some nice colors. colors. <laughs> I literally first cast with that swim bait. The white the white one. That's the uh the little X zone. Yeah, let me grab him. Beauty. He's got a little oh, bit I love the colors Look at the markings on him. Oh look, one right in here. I can probably get him out. Yeah. There. And there he is. Picture that one too, eh? Yeah. Look at that. Nice little... Look at the colors on the tail. I've never seen them so bright and vibrant oh, like bro. that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the colors are awesome. Nice. Yeah, look at that. Look Let at me the show them to the camera. Holy cow, look at that, eh? Look at the that's coloring. Spawning, eh? Yeah, that's spawning. But look at the... I haven't seen one that oh, bright in a long real. time. I've that is so cool. Beautiful golden, man. Look That's at awesome. that. Swim baits, eh? Cool. I'm going to tie you one up, buddy. There he goes. Boom. You try on something different. Bang. There it is, right here. I'll put it back together so you can see what it is. Okay. Big thank you to Blake Ranke. Thanks, buddy. The X Zone did it again. Look at that. Beauty. There'll be a link in the uh, description below if you want to pick some of these up. And uh, they definitely work. Well, that's it. We're done. It's been a pretty slow day, good start to the day. It's a couple of big fish this morning. And uh, Chris has been struggling. A couple of hits, right? Another, another sport I don't do very well. It's been tough, but uh, fun anyway. We're gonna head into the ramp and head back home. And uh, please, if you wanna see any more uh, episodes like this, please hit the subscribe button down below. Don't forget to hit the bell icon. Also, all of the equipment and gear and tackle that we use today, there'll be links down in the uh, description below. I'm Sean Rickard, my buddy Chris King. 
We'll see you next week for another outdoor adventure.